Hey ho guys, welcome to my channel. I am Thomas and I saw that you guys are very interested in my WPL uh, uh, truck with the lifting loading area. So uh, now I want to show you how I got this. Here it is. So I at first a little accident. I slipped off this button, it flies off, and I glue it on with second, uh, second glue. Yeah, and I fucked it up a little bit, so it looks not as nice as like before. But there is a new future. It holds the position when I moved it, and you see. It's lifting. I can remove it down. Yeah, here yeah, this is uh, usually thought for the winch control. With this, um, it's called Res V3. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this button holding doesn't work actually, but. Yeah. So let's start what I did. At first I took a cheap servo and put out the electrics and I got a free space in side of there. Uh, yeah, I sold uh, uh, the wires back directly to the motor, that it's just motor controlled and yeah, uh, yeah, without the electrics, this is empty in this area, so I drilled a hole inside, put this long screw in for that it's able to move. Then, where the servo horn it's usually fits in, I drilled a little bit bigger and um, cut it for the screw that I can put in the screw inside, but this doesn't hold very good. So I fix that again with a second glue. Actually it holds, I'm a bit surprised. This size this is a 12G micro servo. It's a bit weak. Um, yeah. Next time I want to get a bigger one. And yeah. So the lifting spot here is just a screw inside until here. And you see there. I, it's hard to explain for me, but if you see that, I drilled a hole there that it's movable here. This point, yeah, because of the weak servo, I put uh, expanding kitchen bands on that, uh, yeah, it have more tension for lifting. Down is easy, yeah. But yeah, that's it. That's all I did. It's easy, quick. But here in this part, you have to watch that this piece doesn't hit the um, this part for the changing gears. Yeah. Then um, once I had a problem that this hits the uh, servo from the uh, changing gears, yeah. So I, uh, yeah, I, I should use a screw, but a nut, yeah. But I won't put all apart again. So I improve with the zip tie yeah that's all 
all about it's easy quick I don't know I used half an hour of work so this is the You hear? There's the end. It's hitting here, the corner. And you have to stop it because before the servo burns out. Yeah. But this is the degree. What you what we get. It's enough when you make a little bit gas, yeah, and then everything slips down or from the load. It's not very fast. If you this is M3 what I decide for because it's small and I had it here. Next time I will take a bigger screw then it's gonna get faster. Maybe with a bigger servo it's gonna be faster too. But yeah let's see how much time it takes. Yeah, this is a bit more than half a minute. Yeah, on the track it's a little bit boring when you're waiting for it, but this is an acceptable time. Yeah. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. If you have some questions more, you need some picks for doing it by yourself. Yeah, leave, a, leave something in the comment. Yeah.